<laughs> Malaga and Pascal didn't say, oh, la ha. Good. Anyway, Merry Christmas, everybody. I don't exactly know how to say it, but listen, it's Christmas Day. I'm dressed as the elf, and today we're cooking deer meat for dinner. And here's a doll bowl. If you don't know deer meat for dinner, search him. Anyway, thank you, Rob, for the video. It gave me inspiration today. Let's go. Let's cook pork a double. When if you're cooking adobo, you need, in our case, the pork, some rice, some bacon. What's the bacon for? We'll find out in a minute. A potato. Fresh ginger. <laughs> Bawang. Ceboyas. Coconut milk. And... Alak. <laughs> and what do we need the alak for? For the chef to drink, of course. Malaga and Pasco. Let's cook. Before we get started, then we need to have a cheers. <laughs> Masala. So we're going to do two things. We're going to prepare the vegetables, the boang, the ginger, saboyas. I've washed the rice. And now we're going to cook. Let's just do it. Let's just make Filipino adobo made by a British guy influenced by an American YouTuber. Woohoo! <laughs> Cheers. Here we go, guys and girls. We have trimmed the pork. I've taken the fatty bits left in there. I'm gonna boil that down and make a stock for later. Here we got our pork. I'm gonna boil this water now, and I'm boiling some potatoes, which I've cut into small pieces, because they're gonna go into the actual adobo. And I've got my ceboyas, mantequilla, ready to go. Ooh, let's cook a double. <laughs> the dato putri is out. Suka <laughs> vinegar. I put it in the water. Don't know why, but I see Nana doing it all the time. My potatoes are still bubbling. Oh, I'm getting excited. Come on, water. Let's get the pork. Let's get you in. <laughs> In me pork, all ready to go. And there is my ginger and garlic, all chopped up. Right, let's go. Oh, I need an extra pair of hands. So with the assistance of Zoe, we're cooking. Uh, I was hoping this was gonna cook for four people, enough for people, but I'm not so sure if I've done enough. Anyway, within the uh, water I've put, Mr. Datuputi vinegar, sulka. Datuputi soy sauce. Um, I just thought it would help with the flavor because the water from the pork I'm gonna use in the rice. So there you go. Come along everybody, come along. Uh oh, I overboiled it and it all boiled over. And so he went, fire, fire. Oh dear, anyway. I can clean it up afterwards. And the really funny thing was, Zoe went and got her fire truck to try and put the fire out. Oh, here we go. Are you putting the fire out, Zoe? Yeah? Yeah, thank you. What they don't tell you in all these videos is that when cooking in an elf outfit, and I'm sure it's the same in the Santa Claus outfit, it gets very hot. Anyway, we're going to do some stuff. We are going to take the pork and we will drain it. We're going to keep the water for the rice and we're going to start the actual adobo. <laughs> Unlike Robert Errington, uh, I have a rice cooker here. When you're married to a Filipina, you've always got a rice cooker. Right, our pork I've now turned down. It's ready to put in. Um, Unfortunately, I cannot pour the pork in uh, the water and drain it, sorry, because I'm videoing. Anyway, that's what I'm gonna do next. 
The Filipinos, I'm unsure, will tell me whether I'm doing this right or wrong, but I am going to put the rice into the water. Whenever I see Filipinos doing it, they put the water onto the rice. But that's what I'm doing. I'm British, we're gonna try it the British way. I don't know it's the British way, but we're gonna give it a go. Here we go, oh dear, look at this. I think I've burnt the hole. Oops. So boy, yes, bubbling nicely. And here we have the garlic and ginger. Let me just scrape that out. If this had smell vision, wow, you'd be excited. The smell is amazing. Okay, why have I put a pan on the heat here? Actually, it's a bit low, I need to warm it up. Do you remember I showed you earlier the bacon, the lardons as we call it? Let's just melt those down because they're going in with the rice. Hopefully the rice will suck up the flavour of these lardons and the pork stock that I've made. Yeah, the smells are mabang all beautiful. Listen, we need the rice. What do you think of the rice, Sal? Hold on. I'm sure this is not very Filipino, but I'll put the rice into the bacon. I'm not trying to fry the rice, I just wanted to get the flavour soaked up from the pork. So let me now turn that heat off. And let's start cooking the rice in the rice cooker. And you, my friend, are going to have the pork. Ooh, the smells! Right. There we go. In with the pork. <coughs> I'm choking you. Right, in with the pork. My kitchen helper has arrived. So hold on. <laughs> Hello, kitchen helper. No. I had too much broth, so we need to take some of the broth out. Right, let me focus on this. I'm going to put some soy sauce in. Don't know why, but I'm going to. Nay, how's the Filipino cooking going? <laughs> we don't know until they try. Actually, I'm not putting the soy sauce in. False alarm. We are very international in this house because we've got coconut milk from somewhere that isn't Philippines. Probably Thailand, don't know. Anyway. The coconut milk is now in with the pork, the potato, the ginger, the boang. Wow. Anyway. I suppose I should have seasoned the meat really, but anyway, it doesn't matter. Hopefully cooking it in the soy sauce to do it. Put the lid on. Let's come back to it in 10 minutes. Well, it all smells very coconutty, if I may say so. But I suppose adobo does smell coconutty. Um, the rice you can't see, but it's in there. And the rice cooker's on with the bacon inside. Right, let's cook this for 15, 20 minutes, let it simmer down, and then serve up. It's boiling right down now, so it'll turn into a stiffer um, mi mixture, which is good. The rice has just clicked, so the rice is now done. And I can keep warm, and I think probably five more minutes. Cayenne tail. Right, we're serving up. They want to eat, but here we go. Come to your lane. There's plenty enough for four people here. Excellent. Right. Let's get the adobo. We're here. Here we go. Pork adobo. Allah. Robert Errington, deer meat for dinner. And me. Let's see if they'll eat it. Are you going to try my double? 
you a little boy, sure. That's yours, Brendan, the big one. Yeah, yeah, you're a growing boy. Tell us what it's like. You'll try it over there, okay. For those of you who haven't seen Brandon before, he's my nephew from America. Hello. So uh, here you go, Brandon. I need to know honest opinion. Oh dear. It's all right. Excellent. Right, let's try the Filipino, see what they say. What is this? Got a potato in it. Adobo taste, so. <laughs> <laughs> it's not adobo taste, it's like uh, oh, 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 oh. What's it like? It's like uh, pineapple. It's like a pineapple. It's like pineapple. Anyway, so we didn't do pork adobo, we did pork pineapple. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everybody. Yeah, Merry Christmas. Big sister, what do you say? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I can't explain. <laughs> I cannot explain. She forgot her name, baby. I mm. mean, she likes it. <laughs> Look at her face. <laughs> <laughs>